Welcome Sagittarius. This is Renee and welcome back to my channel if you're new. Um, Sagittarius, this reading is going to be for February 1st through the 15th. So if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit the bell so you don't miss any uploads. And take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for more clarity. Sagittarius, if this reading does not resonate, feel free to come back next week. I upload every week so you are able to get another message then. Okay, Sag, what do we have for Sagittarius? February 1st through the 15th. For their greater good. We have learning experience. At the bottom we have guardian angel. So there's someone watching over you, Sagittarius. There's some kind of situation that you've gone through. Maybe that you've felt like you've needed more guidance in. You felt like you needed to know the answers. So you may be looking for a higher power to kind of guide you through the situation and I feel like you have protection you are being protected you have an angel on your shoulder Sagittarius and we have Grand Symphony so happiness is just around the corner and you also have a beautiful uncaging so I feel like this is going to be a time for deep discoveries for you, Sagittarius. There's some kind of information that you're unlocking. Some kind of information that's being revealed and known to you. And I feel like it's making you very happy. Look at this. We got Quest. Yeah, I feel like this situation is taking you on a new journey. <laughs> and we have Discovery. Definitely. It's taking you on a new journey. I feel like you're finding out a lot about yourself and a lot about the situation that you're going through. It's giving you a lot of wisdom, a lot of clarity. I'm feeling like it's giving you a lot of finality, too, because I feel like you're gaining closure from the situation. That's the reason why we have this Grand Symphony here and this quest. I feel like your quest is like a quest of knowledge, a quest of wisdom. And I feel like you're discovering whatever that situation is. You're discovering the answers, Sagittarius. Yeah, we have the Page of Cups. Let's see. What else do we have for Sagittarius? The Temperance. Yeah, I feel like someone's going to come forward to help deliver healing to you. And I feel like... There may be someone who's coming into your life, Sagittarius, that, you know, I feel like they've been very patient about the situation. They've kind of been standing back in the shadows and watching you, but they feel like there's a choice that you need to make. There's some kind of decision that you need to make that, that maybe you're really having a hard time making, but there's a choice that needs to be made. Sagittarius. I feel like someone has a lot of patience in this situation, but I feel like their patience, they can only wait for so long with this King of Swords energy. They're only going to wait for so long for you to make your decision before they feel like they're being denied or they're being, you know, put on the back burner. So, yeah, you have justice on the bottom. So, whatever this decision is, this person who's coming forward really wants you to make a choice, you know, and then put it into action. I feel like this person is letting you know, look at this, with the Page of Cups, we have the Knight of Cups. So this person is coming through very strongly. And I feel like, you know, their patience are only going to go so far. But I feel like this person cares very deeply. Yeah, we have the death card. It, th their patients are wearing thin. They're like waiting for you to make this decision, Sagittarius. They're waiting for you to give them an answer. There may be someone that you may have kind of ghosted. Or maybe there's someone that you're not communicating with. Someone that you don't have any contact with. And they're like 
Well, I've waited really patiently for a Sagittarius, and I feel like they're not interested at all. So I'm going to go ahead and just focus on other, th other things. And I feel like that's the reason why this death card is coming through here. I feel like if they don't get an answer soon, definitely, if they don't get an answer soon, they're going to run with their curiosity. They're going to look up elsewhere for, you know, love and attention with the page of swords the page of swords is very curious they're very outgoing they're only going to wait so long before you know they want to move on and i feel like you know this person who's coming forward i feel like they they're kind of watching you from the background they're kind of taking a look at you to see how you are moving through this situation what kind of you know actions you're going to take but i feel like this person is waiting they really want you to take notice of this situation they really want you to find them valuable find the value that they see in you sagittarius they want you to see them as someone who is a new beginning you have the high priestess on the bottom so whatever the situation is i feel like this person or this situation you need to trust you need to trust your intuition you need to trust yourself that you're making the right decision sagittarius um because I feel like if this is a person, if this is a person that's standing in the backgrounds with this Page of Cups and Knight of Cups, I feel like this person isn't going to wait too much longer. They're, they're going to want an answer. They're going to want you to make a decision. Give me some clarity for Sagittarius. Give me some clarity for Sagittarius in this situation. Yeah, the Four of Wands. I feel like this situation, this person wants some kind of union. They want to celebrate with you. You know, they want to have this happy home, happy family, celebrations, you know, get togethers. They're, they're looking for some kind of situation that's going to bring them a lot of happiness. Definitely the Three of Pentacles. They're really looking for you to see their quality. To see what is valuable within them. You know, they want you to take notice. To take a deeper look. Sagittarius. Yeah, the Page of Swords. This person wants to tell you truth. They want to show you honesty. They want to show you the type of person that they are. And like I said, with this page, now look, we have the Page of Swords on top of the Page of Swords. So this person is definitely curious to find who you are going to choose. You know, if, if you are going to choose them. This person may be looking at your social media. They may be driving past your home, you know. But I feel like this person is really spying on you a little you know they're kind of being a little obsessive but they want you to see the truth you know we have the eight of swords so i feel like in this situation of um sagittarius i feel like you have your reservations you have your reservations about this person. I feel like because you know that they're spying on you. You know th their curiosity. This may be someone who you kind of view as not having only one person. You feel like this person is, you know, out to play games. Out to just pursue what they want and move forward. The King of Swords. Yeah, some kind of truth is coming out. You're going to get some kind of truth in this situation. Oh, 
Oh, sorry, our card fell, so I had to get it. Yeah, we have the Nine of Pentacles. So with the Eight of Swords and the Nine of Pentacles, the King of Swords, Sagittarius, I feel like, you know, this person may be coming in, but I feel like you have your reservations. You are kind of feeling like you want to fly solo right now. You know, you have your guards up. You're not quite sure about this person. You're not quite sure about their intentions. Tell me more about this person. Yeah, we got the Nine of Wands again. So you definitely have your guards up, Sagittarius. And the Temperance. Okay, so I see now. You have your guards up. You're hesitating because you're going through healing, Sagittarius. So this may be someone who's trying to come in on the rebound. And you're just not ready for the situation yet. You're not ready to have another love situation at the moment. You feel like you're carrying enough weight as it is. You have a lot of priorities. You're thinking about your priorities and you're not thinking about love at the moment. Definitely. You're taking a look at what you lost, Sagittarius. Hmm. You have the Seven of Wands. You're protecting yourself. You could also be protecting yourself because you feel like this person is a player. You feel like they're not, they're not someone that you want to waste your time with. Yeah, we have the Five of Cups. Yeah, I feel like this is this is someone that. You really don't want to give your time to Sagittarius. So beware that this person is coming forward, that this person is trying to tempt you into the situation to make a choice. But I feel like you're definitely going through healing. You have the temperance card twice. So I feel like you're very focused on your healing. You're very focused on yourself and your priorities. And you feel like you have more options than just this. You don't want to settle for this option because you feel like it's not right for you. So I totally understand, Sagittarius. Okay, let's get a monology card for Sagittarius. What does Sagittarius need to know in this situation? Conclusions are within reach. So Sagittarius, you're going to get the answers that you need, the guidance that you need. Remember in the beginning when I said, you know, you have a guardian angel on your shoulder. You're being protected. You're being watched over and supported by spirit, God, the angels, you know, whatever it is that you believe in. You're being supported and you're being guided. We also have you're very close to achieving your goals. So I feel like, you know, you're so focused on what it is that you're pursuing. I feel like <laughs> this is like put on the back burner. This is something that you're not even thinking about. You're thinking about yourself, your goals, your dreams. Okay. Let's get some more cards for Sagittarius. What else do we have? Call to action. Take charge. Lead by example. Walk your talk. So say what you mean. Mean what you say, Sagittarius. Don't hold back your communication. If you feel inspired to speak, let it flow. And see, look, we have open communication. Get a weight off of your chest. Speak up with love and be heard. So definitely, at the bottom we have psychic insight. Your third eye is open. See truth for what it is. Follow your intuition. So if you feel like this intuitively is not for you, then chances are, Sagittarius, it's not. 
So follow your gut. Really take a look at your intuition. Trust in yourself. Trust in the path that you want to follow. We have earth pulsing. Pulse of the mother. Slow down. Time in nature. So it may be helpful for you to focus more on yourself. You know, take some time in nature. Really get grounded. Really um, balance yourself. That balance is going to be key. And we also have called soul gifts and training. It's time to step up. So you may have a higher calling than just what this person is trying to deliver to you. You have a higher calling to the, than this. You have bigger and better opportunities than this love, this page of cups, this knight of cups, you know, this king of swords. You have a higher calling than this person. At the bottom, we have inner child, tenderness, innocence, rare gifts. So I feel like, you know, this all deals with that inner child healing, this deep healing that you're going through, that you're being protected for. Okay, Sagittarius. I'm led to, let's see, I'm led to get one more card. Message for Sagittarius, please. Message for Sagittarius. No need to worry. You're being protected. Communicate clearly. Meditation brings answers. So yes. And if you have a question that you need to be answered, your angels are letting you know that the answer is yes, Sagittarius. So that is your reading. If this reading resonates, please like and subscribe, hit the bell so that you don't miss any uploads, and take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for more clarity, Sagittarius. And like I said, if this doesn't resonate, feel free to come back next week. I'll have another message uploaded for you. And Sagittarius, until the next reading, many blessings to you. Love and light.